Hello guys, welcome back to men's dream lifestyle. And as guys as men, we have to make sure that we're not looking like cavemen. Our body hair is gonna play a big role in that. Now I'm not saying that you need to be a hairless specimen. As smooth as a dolphin gliding through the ocean right? But you have to find the right balance between taking care of yourself and your looks. While not going over the top and just being too perfect. But what does that look like how do we find that balance well? That is what today's video is all about. Let's go over 1 what it looks like and 2 how to actually get rid of unwanted hair. Guys if you new here, here men's fashion, fitness, health, trending style, hair care, skin care, lifestyle tips and love tips. So make sure to hit the subscribe button and join our family. Let's start with our nose and ears for example right, there's no reason as to why. You'd want those hair to be visible coming out of your nose, coming out of your ear no body wants to see that. So that's an easy decision. Get rid of any visible nose hairs and any visible ear hair. Because guess what if you can see it then other people can too and it needs to go it's as simple as that. Next let's talk about how to remove unwanted hair for men the eyebrows now. Most guys don't even touch their eyebrows right? Because they're scared it's going to look too feminine or maybe because they just don't care. I'll tell you what? This couldn't be further from the truth. It's not going to be too feminine to take care of your eyebrows. Overly long and bushy eyebrows are just not the way to go. They make you look older than you really are and they make you look unkept. So you don't have to go to a salon and get waxing unless you have a lot going on there like a unibrow. For example, all you need are some good tweezers and just pluck anything in between the brows to avoid that unibrow action there should be two not one alright. Do not use a razor. Because that's too wide and it's just gonna it's not gonna look good alright. It doesn't remove the hair it leaves the root in there so you're not really doing much. Make sure to pluck out and guys unless you're a professional please do not trim your eyebrows with a beard trimmer. It's just not going to look good trust me. Next up how to remove unwanted hair for men we have the armpits and the sensitive areas you know. So unless you're an athlete star swimmer or you really don't like the aesthetic of it. I don't really recommend shaving those areas. Shaving is going to irritate the areas. So that you then have to keep shaving or it's going to look weird and it's going to get very itchy and uncomfortable, when you move your arms, when you walk around. So what I would recommend is it all down with an electric trimmer. Now if you don't have one already or if you're in the market for a new one for to upgrade. Next are the most annoying for me personally hair on the back of the neck. Just because you can't see it doesn't mean that it's not there like everyone else can see it. You know my bun kind of hides it a little bit. But every time I start getting hairy there I'm like Dom here we go again. You know I gotta shave it and then actually use one of these right? Here just a mirror and I'll look at it and shave it. You know and it works okay I think that's probably the best way of doing it unless. You want to ask someone that lives with you to help you out. But the easiest way is to really just make sure that. You have a mirror behind you like your bathroom mirror use that and you're going to be able to see the back of your neck. Then you can go ahead and shave it properly. Go easy do not go too high because otherwise you're going to be screwed. So make sure that you go easy take it easy. By the way that's a really good tip for you guys. Who are letting your hair grow like mine or maybe you're just in between haircuts and your back of your neck gets pretty hairy. So your hairstyle starts to look messy it starts to look unkept. It starts to look like you haven't really cleaned yourself taking care of yourself. So what I would say is in between haircuts make sure that. You're shaving the back of your neck to look like you just got a fresh haircut. Now I get a lot of this question do you shave your arm? So you trim your arms like what do you do with your arms and your legs? Now I would not recommend you shaving your arms. If you want to do it by all means but what I would say is trim it. Shaving it is going to make you feel pretty rough like anyone touches. You hugs you runs their hands through your arms and it's going to be very very spiky very rough. Now I'm pretty hairy you guys have seen it I've talked about it a bunch of times. This is me freshly trimmed right? I just use the trimmer and I literally just trim all the way. I get some hair right here in the back of my triceps as well, so I use that thankfully I don't get much on my back but I definitely make sure that. I trim same for my legs. I do it in the shower, I just go in the shower trim my legs down. Probably once every 10 days or so I trim my arms and my legs. My legs less so than my arms maybe 10 days my legs probably once a month. You know if I know that I'm going to the beach if it's summertime. Then I might do it more often if I'm going on a vacation. Like I said I do it because I'm a hairy person dude. I'd say that most guys probably don't have as much hair as I do lucky you. 
You know you don't have to deal with this but for me I have to make sure that I'm trimming my body so that it doesn't look crazy. Now how about your stomach your abs? I do that same that I do with my arms like a guard number 2 or 3 just on my abs. You know I work out hard every single day and I want to make sure that people can see it. If I take my shirt off, so I definitely do trim it my chest is shaved. Some guys like that some guys don't like that whatever you prefer. It's really guys it's really personal preference. You know some people look at me they're like why you shave your chest. I'm like because I like it. There's no other answer besides I like it makes me feel better makes me feel confident makes me feel more comfortable. Guys make sure to hit the subscribe button and join our family. Thank you guys.